Well, anyway, the article I was uh, I came across that caught my eye was called "When Faith Fails: An Atheist in the Pulpit." That's the February, t and this is just for the February 2008 issue of uh, Psychology Today. Um, it goes on to talk about a um, great number of priests who are. Um, losing their faith. It talks about how you can uh, get debaptized, and you can send your kids to atheistic summer camps. And they're talking about the, um, you know, how it's how it is when um, when ministers of the faith uh, start to lose uh, faith for reasons of legality or trying to um, give people comfort, that sort of thing. But what's interesting is that near the ending of the article, they talk about a possibility for um, a few who have been able to form a spirit, uh, who have been able to form spiritual. Um, basically, this one particular pro uh, prominent bishop um, was able to just move to a more spiritual aversion. Uh, the, Unita the Unitarian Church is providing that same sort of comfort to atheists and agnostics, uh, something more comfortable with just an open uh, format without necessarily believing in God. However, I will get to more in the next video because this is only a symptom of a much larger critical thinking problem.